here tonight. This tale the tape is brought to you by Modelo Especial, brewed with a fighting spirit since 1925. Saki 34, Roundtree Jr. 28. Khalil one inch taller, he will have a three and a half inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions for this main card opener, we turn it over to Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas for UFC 226, Miocic versus Cormier. Presented by Modelo Especial, brewed with a fighting spirit since 1925. And now, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a mixed martial artist holding a professional record. Seven wins, two losses, one no contest. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Khalil Roundtree Jr. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a kickboxer holding a professional record, one win, one loss. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Fighting out of Paz, Turkey, go Khan, the rebel Stalker. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Jason Herzog. Respected veteran referee, Jason Herzog, oh, draws this assignment. The beautiful Brittany Palmer getting us started for round one of a possible three. Five wide with the Octagon girls here tonight on pay-per-view. Gokhan Saki. First round, buddy, 100 ready. 100 pro buddy fights ready. to his credit, Fight. taking on Khalil Roundtree Jr. Roundtree Jr. in white, Saki is in black. Tonight's fight clock is brought to you by Modelo Especial, brewed with a fighting spirit since 1925. Keep an eye out for that right high kick of Saki early on a southpaw round tree. That right high kick is going to be lethal. Saki, the glory light heavyweight champion back in 2014. A lot of kickboxing accolades and credentials. We'll see Saki go early to the leg, then go to the body, then go high. There it is. And then that'll set up his left hook, which is what he's really wanting to land. Stiff left lands for Roundtree Jr. And Roundtree needs combinations, just like he did there. The second, the second Saki comes, combinations. Don't throw one at a time, and you'll get countered by Saki all night. Roundtree Jr., a natural striker, going to be interesting to see how early he shoots tonight. Land of the right hand there. Yeah, Roundtree's throwing some heat, but staying in the pocket against a guy like Gokhan Saki, just turning this into a kickboxing fight, this is very dangerous. Well, His best bet would be to get these exchanges going and then set up a takedown. I agree with you, Joe. And I think that really it's just a matter of time. That's the problem when you do straight stand up. Oh, he's got him. Oh, a big left hand. And that's it. He looks hurt, guys. That's it. As we were saying, Joe, he's got the great stuff. Unbelievable. And that's the problem with four ounce gloves. Anybody can get knocked out. Unbelievable. Silenced everybody. A Beautiful job. in Vegas tonight, Roundtree Jr. Stops Gokhan Saki in round one. And Gokhan is trying to stand up and saying he's okay, but he's on brother legs. That was intense. Wow, Khalil Roundtree Jr. shutting up everybody, including us. What else are you gonna say? I mean, you're saying Perfect. if you stand up with this guy, you're gonna get hurt. He fires a left hand down the middle with four ounce gloves and says, I heard him. <laughs> Incredible. Awesome. That is a giant, giant victory for Khalil Roundtree Jr. The way he did it, look at this here. Boom, straight down the middle, perfectly placed left hand. And then drops the hammers on him. Until the fight is stopped. And how you see him at the end of the fight, he tried to get back up, but he's on rubber legs. Absolutely perfect stoppage. Khalil Roundtree Jr. just shocked the world. He's knocked out one of the best kickboxers alive today. 
period of all time. One of the best of all time. He just knocked him out. And this is an evolving, mentally maturing Khalil Roundtree Jr. We said off the top he was going to embrace the 15 minutes here tonight. And notice the patience after the initial knockdown to not force the issue. Made those ground strikes count. Khalil Roundtree Jr. The official decision brought to you by Metro PCS. Get knockout coverage of the UFC on a network that covers 99% of people in the U.S. To make this one official here now, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Jason Herzog has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute 36 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Khalil Roundtree Jr. I am here with the winner, Khalil Roundtree Jr. You just shocked the world. Winning this fight and winning the way you did is a, an absolutely huge accomplishment, beating literally one of the best kickboxers ever with a straight left hand. How satisfying is that? It's very satisfying, Joe. And you know what? Yes, he's a kickboxer, all this stuff. But people act like when I come in this cage that it doesn't just take one punch to lay somebody out. So here I am. I'm here. Let's go. Let's go. Khalil, take a look at the big screen and, and enjoy this. This is a perfectly placed left hand. Now, conventional wisdom thought that if you were going to win this fight, you're going to win it on the ground. But that is just an absolutely perfectly placed left hand. I'm not a ground fighter. I'm a striker. I'm here. I'm doing MMA. I went over to Black House with Kenny, worked my wrestling, worked my MMA. I'm developing all around. I'm new to this. I'm young to this. But you know what? That doesn't take away from the hard work that I put in in every area. But this is the type of finishes I like to see. So let's do it. Congratulations on a huge, huge victory. Khalil Routtree Jr., ladies and gentlemen. Happy birthday, Anthony.